bodies on Earth. The Indian astrology is perhaps one of the oldest astrology in the world. One thing that is very peculiar about Indian astrology is that the fact that it has considerable differences in its principle and logics from the Western astrology. However, even though many theses have been written on this, there are some best kept secrets which no one wants you to know regarding astrology. And today we have scooped them out just for you. Every 12 years of your life, from age 12, 24, 36, 48, 60, 72, 84, 96 and onwards, you will have luck in one area of your life, usually the same one. This is your Jupiter return. Depending on how old you are, now look back at what happened around these times. When you hit the next milestone, you will get more of the same. Never buy a phone, computer, car, make travel arrangements, sign a contract, launch a website, publish a book, start a magazine, open a shop or begin anything to do with communication when Mercury is ready. Retrograde. Mercury rules communication and transport and if everything falls at the wrong time, things will never work in your favour. Expect issues around your father, stepfather or the person who acted as the father figure influence in your life to come up around your birthday. Pay attention to these even if the person is no longer with you. These thoughts and feelings need to be addressed and healed. Don't make a major decision in the 5 days before or on or the 5 days after an eclipse. Again, and we tell you the dates of these in our forecast. If you do something major around these times, you are not likely to get the result you are looking forward to. Don't tell a Gemini or a Librin your secret. Geminis love to gossip. Libras won't mean to give it away, but if they have a few drinks, well enough said. Scorpios will take your secret to the grave, but this gives them power over you. Never start an argument with an Aries if you want an early night. Never act needy around a Sagittarian. And and don't make jokes about a Cancerian's mother or children. That's a wrap on today's show. For more such updates, you better get back to Connect the Dots.